Gents, this is my intelligence. It's me, Beardy, and today we're going to be looking at the hidden signs a woman wants to be approached. Kay's on vacation, so I think it's just me and you today. It's not always easy to pick up on these cues, but while you're throwing away money on student loans, we're going to give you a bit of free education. And yes, we know we've already made a video like this before, but here's the thing. When it comes to learning how to approach a girl, there's no such thing as too much information. Besides, ever since we had that video published, we've been getting more signs a girl wants you to approach her from our viewers through the comment section, hence this second video. So with that, let's look at the seven more hidden signs that the door's actually wide open. And we're also going to show you the number one obvious sign she wants you to approach her. Let's begin, because the sooner you learn how to talk to girls, the better. Number 7. A Good Old Fashioned Ribbing When you're about to approach a woman, you have to be ready for her defenses. That's natural. But not all defenses are created equal. That's right. What are you doing here, Kay? Illustrating your point. One of my defenses, especially when I'm trying to avoid a creeper, is to disappear. But don't worry, Beardy, you're not a creeper. Now, fellas, if a woman isn't into you, she's going to avoid you like the plague. Or she'll flat out tell you she's not interested before you can even say hello. This is exactly the type of woman you don't want to waste your time on. Others will be a bit more subtle at first, but will become more aggressive in their denial of your advances the longer you push it. However, one of the signs she wants you to talk to her is if she responds to your advances with a few well-placed, insightful, and on point insults. If she's interested, she's going to want you to put in a little work to gain her affection. Calling your mama fat isn't an example of this. On the other hand, if she asks you if you know Joe, Joe mama, she's simply toying with you to see if you have a sense of humor. Furthermore, if she makes slight jabs at you, for instance by playfully mocking you or giving you a silly nickname, you can bet your ass she's interested. It seems counterproductive though, doesn't it? If you like someone, you want to be nice to get them to like you, right? wrong. Even though her energy may appear to be negative on the surface, it's actually a hidden invitation for you to stick with it. Us ladies are a cunning bunch who rarely lay all our cards on the table, so don't immediately get defensive if we're teasing you. We're simply trying to see if you're confident enough to be taken down a notch. Oh, and speaking of misreading situations, check out this video on how to detect signs she wants you to talk to her. Number 6. Jet Sweep or Ride the Pine Katie, you like sports? No, and I'm not really interested in learning about them. No problem. I'll teach you a thing or two. No, wait. Fellas, if you've ever approached a woman at a bar, your natural oh. instinct is to focus all your attention on her. But when you're nervous, you may talk a little too much about the things you like and forget to listen. Or you'll miss some of the body language signs she's attracted to you, which, if you don't shut up about yourself, she'll never display. That's right, Kay. So if you're into sports and you keep giving unsolicited sports facts, there's a pretty good chance the woman you're trying to impress will lose interest and you'll be riding the pine. Wait, what does that mean, riding the pine? Sitting on the bench, Kay, not playing the game, and you've just illustrated my point, so thank you. Huh? If a woman starts expressing interest in some hobby that you know, or have a feeling she's not into, like sports, is one of the hidden signs she wants you to approach her and stay there. But I'm not expressing- Just roll with it, Kay. Here's the thing, fellas. Women will ask you what they want to know, so don't just start rambling off this cool knowledge about yourself unless she asks. A good rule of thumb, if she asks you thoughtful questions about the things you do or like, she's interested and wants to keep talking to you. All right, fine. You make a good point, and I learned something. You're still a jerk. And there's that playful teasing you talked about earlier. Don't want to ride the pine? These body language signs she's attracted to you will help you avoid it. Number five, it's all in the eyes. All right, lady killers, let's take a moment to clear up one often touted myth. Just because a woman looks at you doesn't mean she wants you to approach her. I mean, yeah, it can be intimidating to know what to do when a girl looks at you. But as Maverick from the movie Top Gun would say, she's walked into a target-rich environment. I've never seen Top Gun. What does that mean? Ah, now you get to learn a thing or two, Beardy. It means she's scanning the room. She might even lock eyes with you for a minute. But at this stage in the game, oh, and believe me, it's a game, she's scanning for threats. This is instinctive. At this point, she's looking for anything that's going to cause her harm, wreck her night, or not pay her bar tab. And yeah, she's looking for the opposite, too. But she's more worried about the threats. That's because millions of years of evolution have programmed us human beings to search for threats, be they lions on the Serengeti or douchey frat boys on an early happy hour. 
So what's the key here, Kay? Patience, young Padawan. Baby Yoda's cuter than old Yoda? Hush, Beardy. Guys, you should never confuse an initial glance for bona fide interest. That's a rookie mistake. Instead, be patient and wait for multiple eye locks. Again, Maverick would implore you to keep her on your radar screen. So keep her in your peripheral vision and occasionally send some glances her way. If you get that third eye lock, go for the missile lock and make your approach. She's not trying to hide her interest anymore. Want to know more about what to do when a girl looks at you? Check out this video. Number four, what's the Wi-Fi password? One day, a few years back, I was sitting in a coffee shop. I was busy being good looking, browsing through my social media feed and using the shop's Wi-Fi. Then all of a sudden, this ridiculously attractive woman walked up to me and asked me for the Wi-Fi password. At first, I was confused. Why didn't she just ask the barista when she ordered the coffee she was carrying? Did she not know the password was printed on the menu and drawn on the chalkboard behind the counter? And then it hit me. She was asking me because she wanted to talk to me. She wanted me to approach her, but I was too busy staring at my phone to catch it. So I used some playful teasing Kay mentioned earlier, and I told her that I'd only give it to her if she sat down with me and had a five-minute conversation. I delivered it with a smile, of course, and it worked. We talked for hours and dated for months. So here's the bottom line. A random ask or a question that didn't need to be asked is a sure sign that a woman wants to be a pro. So always have some topics in the back of your brain in case you ever unexplicably find yourself talking to a cute stranger that you hadn't noticed. For other obvious but easy to miss signs that a girl wants you to talk to her and some not so obvious, check out this video. Now guys, I know we're talking a lot about the hidden signs that a woman wants to talk to you, but before you crack the code of the female psyche, you also need to pay attention to one of the most obvious body language signs that she's attracted to you. So stay tuned for a refresher that will really increase your odds of knowing how to approach a girl. Now on to the last three on our list. Number three, the drunk dial. Now, gents, I'm not going to let you down, but I'm going to give you a word of caution. The drunk dial is a double-edged sword. Yes, if she's intoxicated and then somehow manages to find your contact info on her phone, it definitely means you're on her mind. And I 100% believe that when people are drunk, they'll do and say things they're too afraid to do while sober. You know, hidden things like hidden signs a girl likes you things. Alcohol pulls out our deepest feelings. It's why you'll never find yourself on the dance floor unless you've had a couple of drinks. However, it's in this moment, the moment a woman calls you with the house music blaring in the background that you need to remember one thing. Asking her out is the absolute worst thing you can do. She's probably not going to remember that she called you in the first place, so she's definitely not going to remember you asking her out. So what you'll need to do is something we've told you about time and time again. Listen. The more you listen, the more information you'll gather. Information that you can use in the sober light of day. So the next morning when she's nice and hungover, you can shoot her a text and say something like, Someone had a fun night last night. Smiley face. And with that, you should be able to start a conversation and ask her if she'd like to have a night like that with you sometime. Want to know more of the hidden signs a girl likes you? Check out this video where we give you five of those. Number two, getting quirky. If you're watching our videos and reading our content, there's a good chance you're like me and you've got a little bit of a nerdy side. Now, if you're trying to hide yours to feel like you don't have one, you should consider finding it and tapping into it. Why? Well, women like authenticity. Too often we spend too much time projecting an inauthentic image of what we think someone will want. But reality is that when you reveal your inner self, you immediately become more likable to everyone you meet. So the next time you're wondering when to approach a woman, do it when you're feeling most like yourself. That's when you're most confident. Psych yourself up if you have to, because when a woman wants to be approached, she's going to do the same thing. Be herself and have fun. She's essentially putting on a show. And if you pair this sign with a few other signs in this video, like eye locks, you can be pretty sure she's putting on that show for you. And if she's showing you her nerdy side and goofy side right off the bat, you can bet she wants you to approach her. Number one, rock that body. In the same way that a woman uses her body to put up defenses to let you know she's not interested in being bothered, there are several hidden factors that are actually common signs she's flirting. Now, you probably know the playing with the hair, leaning in, or lightly touching your arm, but you might not know that when she runs her finger around the rim of her glass, it's a telltale subconscious sign that she's picking up what you're putting down. Likewise, licking her lips isn't just signaling she might need some help from her chapstick. Nope, it's another subconscious sign. So don't just look for the classic signs like blushing or brushing her hair behind her ear. No, guys, dig a little deeper and use the intelligence part of intelligence. Want to learn how to look for common signs she's flirting? We have a separate video made for that. Check it out. The number one obvious sign a woman wants to be approached. 
Guys, I know we've gotten a little deep in the weeds looking for hidden signs that she wants to be approached, but that doesn't mean that all signals are cleverly disguised or subconscious. In fact, our friends at Psychology Today tell us that we're all actually pretty bad at picking up when someone's flirting with us. See, because both women and men fear outright rejection, we tend to underestimate when we're actually the subject of someone's attention. And so our flirting tends to take on an indirect or hidden, if you will, tack that gives us a plausible out if we feel like the encounter isn't going our way. But that means we tend to overlook when we're being obviously and overtly flirted with. So don't be so quick to dismiss a situation that seems like you're obviously being hit on. It's rare, and it goes against our instincts as guys. But training your brain will pay off in the long run. So, what do you think about our off-the-beaten-path social interactions? Do you want to know more on hidden signs she wants you to approach her? Let us know in the comments section. Guys, if you need more information on knowing when a girl actually wants to talk to you, check out this video here. Thanks for watching, and happy hunting!